This is a video showing how to take a small, inexpensive uh, window air conditioner and operate it inside a room. Uh, in this particular case, I'm going to use it to air condition a boat. Uh, for those not familiar with how these units work, uh, it pulls in air in the front and blows out cold air through a coil called the evaporator. And in the back, it sticks out the window so it so it outside air comes in the side, it has vents on the side, and then exhaust out through a coil in the back called a condenser. And normally, you know, if you just were to run this inside the house, it would simply heat up the room because it would be blowing out more hot air than it would be making you cold. But by using duct work and a little sheet metal, we're going to modify this so that we can pull air in from an outside source in this case, it's going to be the front half on my boat. It's a piece of glass there that lifts up. And I'm going, I'm going to make a plywood uh, template that fits on where the screen goes. And I'm going to duct it, uh, pull in air from the outside, and then blow the hotter air uh, also to the outside. So we'll be pulling air and exhausting it all in a closed uh, system. Uh, a lot of you may not uh, be familiar with boat air conditioners, but they're very expensive. They can, a uh, small unit like this could get in two thousands. So uh, it's, this is much better uh, uh, idea. It's a uh, small unit like this, are very reliable and very inexpensive. This only cost $126. And just a little duct work, it should not decrease its efficiency. It might possibly even increase the efficiency because I'm adding a, uh, an extra fan, a uh, duct fan to it. So we'll uh, go ahead and get started. Okay, here's where I've installed uh, the duct fan. It came as a complete unit with the cord. And what I did is I put it in a piece of eight inch duct. And the re one of the reasons I bent my tabs down when I cut the hole is I secured it with a stainless steel duct clamp. Fairly simple. Uh, another thing I did since this was uh, made, unit was made smaller than a standard eight inch duct, is I took some of this uh, weather stripping and put a few pieces top and bottom to kind of isolate it so it won't tend to vibrate and make a noise. And uh, that's really all there was to it.
here it is in the cabin and as you can see it's very quiet what I'm going to do is uh, disconnect the boost fan just to show you a difference in the noise it's not a whole lot it's on maximum cool uh, right now and that's with the boost fan off Vent with the boost fan 